This is home. For me, I, I got no other place to go. Serge Gendron is a longtime resident at the Turnhead RV Park. This unit has been at this site since 1997. It hasn't moved since. And for the landlord to give me this notice, I was a shock. The park's owner handed out a notice to residents in June, notifying them that he will be retiring and closing down the business at the end of October. The notice also stated water and electricity would be shut down. Gendron says he took this case to the residential tenancy branch with the help of an advocate. The RTB has ruled that Gendron is a tenant and therefore protected by BC laws. He has a right to close the park under the Act, but there's proper notices. There's 12-month notices. There's a minimum $20,000 compensation for those folks. The authority says the notice given out by the landlord is not effective because it's not an approved form, so the tenancy continues. The landlord declined an interview request by CBC News, but says his intention to retire and close the site remains the same. The owner of the park says this site can take up to 120 RVs and is currently 40 percent full. Terence Haber says he's been living at the RV park for seven years. It gives me independence and allows me to live in my own place. I like the setting. I would likely be homeless if I had to leave. What do you feel about the pressure right now in the housing market? Um, it eliminates me from any possibility um, financially. His sister helped him file a dispute resolution to the RTB, and they are waiting for the decision. This is happening to a lot of parks, so there's very few vacancies. Um, I think you were looking, and you could, you would have to go as far as Chilliwack. I think it was between Chilliwack and Hope. Yeah. Legay says around 15 people at the park are planning to file a group dispute resolution to the RTP as well. Pinky Wong, CBC News, Surrey.